When we think about weddings, we think about young love. People in their 20s and 30s starting a life together. But a recent viral video shows an 80 year old grandmother shopping for a wedding dress. So this got us thinking about love later in life. This is what Blanca Cobb, who has a master's degree in psychology and I are talking about today. So Blanca, let's get right to it. What is it about this video that's resonating with people so well? One reason I think it resonates with so many people because it gives hope about love. People tend to think as you get older, you can't find love. It's really for the young. And what this grandmother, this idea of grandmother is showing is that that is not the case. You can find love at any age. You know, when I was younger, people were always pushing that, you, you know, get a husband, get married, you know, have the kids. Why do people think that they can't find love at older ages? A lot of this thinking is self-limiting and downright wrong. They think with age comes aches and pains. Yep, you do get older, which means some people might have some health challenges. They think they might have too much baggage, whether they have children, they have Ill illness, or maybe they're recovering some, some kind of gambling debt or perhaps um, some kind of addiction, or they think they're not enough. They're not fit enough. They're not successful enough. You can just fill in the blank with whatever they think is going to stop them from finding love. But it's it's just not the case because what you're doing is you're selling yourself short. Not only that, but you're also limiting somebody else's capacity to really love you and you're not in their heart and you're not in their mind. Oh, I just love that. So for those who have not yet found their special someone, how do you find love at an older age? you have to be open to it. So at any age, you have to be open to love. You have to invite love in. So what that means is if you want love, you have to show love. And what have we heard about love? That it's kind, that it's gentle, that it's accepting, that it's forgiving. If that's what you want in your life, you have to welcome it in your life, which means you have to show it. And you'll be amazed that when you do, that people are gonna start noticing it. And it actually draws people to you because it's almost like this magnetic force. Great advice, I'm, I'm taking some notes, Blanca. Thank you so much for your insight. You can continue the conversation with Blanca on her Facebook page, Blanca Cobb, Body Language Expert.